Okay, so here we have the inside of the, my C57D and um, it shows how the motors are placed around the, <clears throat> the stairway and the ramps and uh, these are motors that I got on eBay from a company called Victor Studio and it's got a, a threaded rod here and a nut and attached to the nut um, let's get one here that's a little more visible. <clears throat> Attached to this nut is an arm that runs over to a link that's attached to a cross shaft, a steel cross shaft, on each of the three, um, each of the three legs. And of course, in the final model, none of these wires will be showing. They'll all be hidden um, inside the perimeter. I've got some cavities here. You can see where I hogged out these sections for the motors and I've got covers for them. But I'm going to be hogging out these sections for electronics, uh, for the RC electronics and also maybe a, a cavity over here for a soundboard. Uh, I've been talking to a company called Blue Point Engineering <clears throat> that seems to have a pretty good selection of uh, RC controls and also soundboards and a bunch of other stuff. And here you can see in three places I've got um, provision for lights and one of these motors will have a little uh, little switch on it so that when the, the ramps get actuated the, the switch will turn on the lights in each of these three, uh, <clears throat> three ramps and it should show you know fairly nice lighting underneath when the ramps come down. Um, and let's see what else I still have to work on. I still have to work on the fusion core. Uh, I've got, I've already got the, uh, the mechanisms done. I need to work on the LED lighting for that now and probably end up with uh, 40 or 50 lights inside there. Uh, so that's pretty much it for now. I think maybe on the next installment I had a couple of requests to show how these uh, ramps are attached and uh, that'll be the next the next video that I that I show.